Hello, hello, and welcome back to Leaky Gaming, and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources, the Soviet Republic, or Soviet Republic. And we call it Project Leshche, because this is our town Leshche. If you remember, town Leshche was this here. R -r -r, my bad. Was this here. Practically what whatever this greenery here covers. And then it grew, and then it grew. And then it grew that it has two kind of suburbs, Varstok and uh, Zarnoviets now. And uh, practically I believe there's more people living in this area here than actual Lesche. And we have two satellite towns, Baraharad, which is starting soon its own food production. It must be this up. And uh, we have Avkavisk which even has party headquarters. Lovkovisk is a proud and joy and doesn't have really high quality buildings. I mean, they are high quality buildings, but um, wow, they're filling in fast. <laughs> uh, I can already see they have some a little bit of an issue here with sports, so I'm gonna give them a sports ground and... Can we place one like here? This would be nice and uh, yes, indeed we can. Why not? Let's just place it here. I'm pretty sure they, that um, it's gonna serve the purpose. And uh, more or less, now that we have all these people working here, I have a feeling that our mines are suffering. Uh, so, I don't know. Not really. What about here? Yeah, this is full. Okay, I, I'm gonna say that everything is working out. Uh, we might expand the population a wee bit more, but uh, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. For now, it looks like it's okay. And I was thinking keeping it stable around that number. Now, let me show you what I did uh, here. And if you didn't by now, please consider subscribing, liking the video, you know, all that good stuff. Uh, and uh, let's see what we did here. We have a... Did we start producing, uh, uh, constructing this? No. Where are you guys going? Oh, you're done with this one. Okay, so they're done with leveling this uh, construction set. No, it's only steel and mechanical components. Well, steel mostly. And uh, yeah, why not? Let's continue with the nuclear power plant. All uh, right, right, right. Yeah, let's go with this one as well. So three of them can go here and one of them needs to be here. Okay, so we are um, in final stages of, uh, of production here. And also, uh, I expanded this, um, the, the Zarnoviets, to two, not one, but two distribution offices. And also six additional buildings. I will moderate them a bit. I'm just gonna give them ten people each to work here. And we're gonna start populating Zarnoviets. I'm gonna check if anything is populating on its own, but I'm pretty sure it's not. We're gonna have to be the ones who do the legwork. Uh, here we go, and uh, this is the last one. Well, also we're gonna do the same for the construction offices. Oh, there are big ones. They require a lot of um, a lot of people working in them, so we're gonna give them 10 people each for now, uh, just because uh, I'm gonna populate a lot of places and uh, I need people to work elsewhere, like shops and uh, sports centers, I mean, as soon as they're done with the buildings, as um, uh, soon as they're done with the buildings, it's gonna be... Um, they're gonna start working in the mines and uh, going to the bus stop, which uh, the tro trolley bus tra trolley bus stop, which is gonna take them away uh, to the mines. I hope. And the other line could uh, leave the uh, lead them here. But is this connected to the bus stop? Actually, in 399 meters, they can even go to work in a steel mill. That's incredible. But anyway, we'll we'll see. We're gonna have a lot of people, we'll, a lot of requirements for them to work here. So should be fine okay so how are we doing with the power this is one one of my uh, kind of issues when do we reach the limit of power production i know we have these scales here and whatnot but uh, uh are we working okay here steel mill wow iron how is iron <laughs> how is iron lacking this is incredible i have no idea what's happening with these guys here so what's with you Okay, there's no iron coming here. 
uh, in larger quantities. Okay, and they're mining it, they're mining it. Anyway, it looks like we stabilized the production. Um, kinda. Oh, here we go, okay. This exploded again, but uh, that's gonna be changed. That's gonna change soon. Right, so they're almost close, almost... Uh, you know what? Maybe I'm gonna remove this. I'm not sure. Okay, let's leave it like this. This is just potentially if we need to expand that way, but I'm pretty sure that I don't want to expand anymore. And we're gonna have to squeeze in a couple of kindergartens, and we're gonna have to squeeze in um, uh, sports grounds and stuff like that. So, let's start slowly. So, unfortunately, uh, let's see, do we have any people working anywhere? No. Let's go for a hundred people in each one of those buildings. And let's go for a hundred people here. Now, until this building is done, I'm not gonna connect this with um, with the... Oh, actually, I already lowered it to 20 people. Okay, so maybe I can connect it to the to, to this area here. So, uh, so some of them can come and work here. Unfortunately, they're rushing directly to the <laughs> chemical plant. Uh, right. Maybe, maybe, maybe we should finish one of distribution office so our chemical plants can actually start producing something. Yeah, there's quite a few of them going there. But that's fine, okay. <laughs> Are you gonna start moving in here next to these buildings? What about, uh, do we have workers in these shops and whatnot? Yeah, school is working out. Kindergarten is working, that's fine. Okay. So they're building, what kind of road are they building here? What does it say? No, asphalt only. Okay, that's perfect. We don't need the uh, workers going there, so after this asphalt is done and they level it, that's gonna be fine. Okay, uh, let's continue on. Uh, what do we have here? We have food industry being built. Oh wow, there's uh, so much... Well, actually, why not? So much workers coming to construct this building, but uh, they're not really doing much because we need bricks and boards. And uh, yeah, they're gonna have. They're bringing it all the way from here, so that's gonna take a while. Now, what I was thinking, what I was thinking, I was thinking a lot of stuff, but I'm not sure if uh, it's viable to do. And suddenly, this uh, distribution office is really, really busy. So um, I have no idea what they're doing. I just don't know. I just don't know what their guys are doing. At one point there's too many uh, trucks here and at another time there's no trucks here so I have no idea what they're doing. Okay, coal runners are emptying our coal supplies. How are we doing with the coal supplies? This means that mine is working nicely. What about Varstok? Varstok population is full, full to the end. Like every single building is, is full. I think this is our pride and joy community and also I think they deserve since okay I wanted to say since they are not doing any project at the moment oh so why don't you have any access oh boy okay okay so what do we have here what did I do here so you have a red light why you have both okay you have a red light because Actually, here you should have a straight chain. Yeah, you do. Okay. Why do you have issues returning back then? So where are you, where are you supposed to go? Construction office. So go. Okay. So this is by lane. Okay, and then what? Uh, I can give you... I can give you this. And then this one can have straight through. Is that helpful? It doesn't seem to be helping. Okay, must be something we did with the semaphores here, with um, with uh, these unloading. So, let, oh boy, I can see it here. Uh, here we go. There we go. 
Yes, yes, yes. Indeed, indeed, it's fixed. So he can go back all the way. Uh, do we need this? Why not? Let's just leave it as it is. Right, building on fire. Which one? Where are we? Okay, one of the f uh, clothing processing uh, factories. Okay, they're actually doing quite well. Uh, working at 60 out of 80 people, that's a big number. How are we doing with the traffic here? I think we have too many trees, so we can't even see what's happening here. A lot of trucks coming in and out, delivering what seems to be... Okay, stop. Okay, this one is delivering chemicals, so what's the problem with chemicals? Why aren't you delivering enough chemicals? He's delivering chemicals for export, so he's going here and then fabric factory, right? And then... Yeah, he never actually gets there because we, we require much more chemicals than... Okay, he has one ton of chemicals. Yeah, we had, we're just consuming much more chemicals than, the, than, than we can... Uh, uh, we're consuming, then we can produce. Okay. I didn't realize that, that chemicals are so difficult. Difficult would be the best word. Okay, we have these guys here, so we can pay the imports, but I don't really want to. I want to get these construction offices. I don't really... You know what? We can get a small woodcutting post here. Uh, that would definitely shorten our wood supply. And uh, so let's see. It's somewhere, somewhere, just a wee bit safer. You know. So th obviously this is gonna be where we're gonna outsource our wood. So let's do this. Uh, small road going from here. Right, and then a uh, small con uh, wood chop chopping outpost. That would be somewhere under. No, no, no. That's under various industry and wood cutting post. Yes. Yeah. If we put it somewhere around here, we even gonna be sourcing people from the from town. And we really, I'm pretty sure that we really won't need a lot of uh, trees for this. So you can construct that as well. Oh, really? They're building this and this one is constructing this. The world makes sense one more time. And this is a petrol station. Yes, indeed, we're building that as well. Right, uh, one of the things we should also source or supply or uh, distribution office, have a distribution office for, is fuel. But I have no... Distribution office probably should be close to the refinery, but... Uh, da -da 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 -da. All right, okay, now this looks kind of attractive, more so than it did before. So let's try doing this. I think it's only... Um, by God's divine mercy that we didn't uh, get any fires here. Yeah, we're not gonna do anything about it. So I have a feeling that there's gonna be a really nice spot for a, a distribution office here. Obviously it's gonna be a well sourced with electricity and everything else. Right, do we go with a big one? Yeah, why not? Okay, I'm just gonna pause for a second because I wanna squeeze it in here. And also before the construction of this starts, I wanna, I wanna build the asphalt roads here. As ugly as they might be, I'm still gonna build them. Just so we can have a fast, um, Fast transportation. Uh, right, this is kind of tucked in right there, or maybe even it's not even supposed to be. <laughs> so how are we doing here? Okay, we don't have any crops here. Crops here are so-so. And uh, who are you? You are alcohol runner. Okay, so we're missing crops here. Actually, 
Here they are. 214 tons of crops. Oh, almost done, almost done, almost done. Okay, let's do the industrial connection. Let's cancel this one and create a new. Um, da -da 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 -da. Uh, yeah, let's let's leave them to construct it on their own. Uh, I think it might just be proper amount of time because um, they just require gravel and asphalt, so that's gonna be okay. Uh, are they constructing this? Okay, gravel is being delivered. Okay. Okay. A uh, road here to the buildings still not done, but the road to here is done, so soon they're gonna be constructing these little uh, roads left and right of the buildings. So they're gonna start working on the buildings, and we have... Oh, gravel is already here. Oh, a new vehicle type available, only using dollars. That's a bus, that's harmonica bus. Or a stretch bus, I'm not sure if that's the proper name. Okay, so we have even workers working here. Do we have first uranium being built? Because we do have everything that we need. Oh no, we don't, we need chemicals. Okay, I think it's about time for us to start considering uh, creating all these chemicals. And uh, one thing I haven't considered, and maybe I should have, can we squeeze, uh, so this can hold on for the chemicals, stockpile the chemicals. Should we have a single point of uh, pickup? No, no, distribution office, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure distribution office would be able to deal with this. Uh, yes, yes, and yes. All of this is a yes on can we connect it and uh, build it. And no, no, I'm just gonna deal it on the individual basis. So, um, probably it's, uh, one of the offices is gonna be assigned for loading and unloading here, and then chemicals are gonna be delivered both here to uranium conversion plant and uranium nuclear fuel fabrication. Jarnoviets and Jarnoviets. And technically this is a different county. Uh, Zigebovar. Yes. So we are <laughs> we are technically not mining anything. Well barely anything is working. We do have people working, but uh, still no production of um, uranium conversion or from con uranium conversion plant but uh, so that's a matter of time because we have all these empty buildings here and no work for our people well students have to go to college now that's an interesting thing do we build a line maybe we can so we can extend the lines we have all the lines we have here I'm gonna have to sit down and rework those lines because there's way, way too many of them. Oh, nice Polish vehicle is going away. This is fire is out. Now, will <coughs> will Barahara the fire department and maybe Volkovisk fire department be enough to cover the uh, Zharnovitz nuclear power plant? And we have, it's not really close, but there's a um, there's a there's a fire department here. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, we're gonna experiment first, and <laughs> we'll see how the what the future will bring. Oh wow, 20 people here. How do you get there? Oh, buses. Yeah, probably they were delivered by buses. Um, yeah, I can give you 40 people because that's how many fits in a bus. As I I only if you have any something to do. But I can see here trucks coming in bringing concrete, but bringing concrete both here and here. What are you bringing? What's this truck? Oh yeah, the, the small, the dumper ones. Well, small, they have 7 capacity and they're 87 kilometers per hour, I believe. Okay, so we are constructing the 
three final buildings. One of them is halfway through. 20% and 20% uh, of our project here. And as I said, we're getting people here on the construction site. And uh, there's going to be people working. Whoa! They're going up. Okay, sports grounds. They're actually going up the number of people. So they're moving in here. That's awesome. So let's start with the sports grounds then. I think obviously one of them is going to be here. Maybe just build it here. That it's connected to everything. That would be the best. Next to a pub. That's how we did it. Uh, yes. Why? Why wouldn't there be power? Okay, I'm worried now, slightly. What if I cancel this? Why wouldn't there be power here? What in the world? Okay. For some reason... Okay. Now there's power. What? Uh, that was strange. Okay, now everything is fine. I'm gonna pretend nothing happened here. Okay, these guys are doing their job and uh, what's now? Laying asphalt and then it's gonna be leveling asphalt. Okay. Or rolling the asphalt. Okay, next stop we have our food production. The only thing is not still not connected with the... It's still not connected with uh, with uh, 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 crops. So how much they can process? 40 tons a day. Huh. Come on, chop chop. I need this finished. Uh, you know what? I'm actually kind of anxious to see this. <laughs> Look at the food growing slowly. Okay, and food dropping, crops dropping here. Okay, so we're getting there. We're getting... Whoa, this is skyrocketing. Okay, um, I think we have a problem in to start distributing this uh, food somewhere. Okay, so we have how many... How many... <laughs> I think we're just gonna be full of food, as it seems here. Uh, and people, are they actually going here and working manually? They actually are. What? That's fine. I'm just gonna let them be. Okay, I'm gonna have to start experimenting sooner or later with the smaller uh, the, the, the the supply depots are gonna work out or not. So, so you you're gonna pretend that you're not uh, you're gonna pretend that you don't like the this. Okay, but let's try to level and then squeeze it in. So um, Let's go with small distribution office. Looks like this is the best way to go. Oh, here we go. Okay, that's another one. Um, and are we constructing any of those distribution offices? We have uh, two of them here. We have one of them here in the middle of the oil field, which is going to take a while to build. But uh, they're still working. They're already working on the asphalt laying. And how is our oil field doing? So tank is done. Uh, is this? This is not even assigned anywhere. Okay, I'm fine with that. Uh, I will finance this on my own because we can start pumping oil. Yes, indeed. And this is working and this is pumping oil and we have... Yep, oil is incoming. Right, right, right. So, do we have... Why is there... Is it just me or... I have quite few of them not assigned. So, let's do this one more time. I'm just gonna take uh, this construction office and uh, this construction office. And I'm just gonna assign some of those oil field buildings to both of those guys. I will just check... Okay, so nobody is assigned to this one. Okay. You are assigned to this one, and you are assigned to this one. Okay. Next one is this. Again, the same story. So uh, I just want to check adjacent pump as well. So 
this and uh, a pipe pump. Listen to him. And I have no idea what I'm talking about. Okay, assigned. Yeah, these are all being constructed, so I think they're all fine. Uh, that's gonna take some time, but uh, look, they have power. Power is here. We have transformer stations. Some of them are pumping oil already. And we have half a, half a cart, half a wagon of, uh, of uh, oil already ready to be transported. But I don't have direct connection with the... Uh, with the... Uh, the... the, the, the uh, train depot. Actually, I do. It can go all the way around and then I'm going to pick up the oil. Okay. Uh, since this one has a, such a short trip to go now, oil loading and unloading, let's see how the oil is doing here. Okay, it's dropping. This is the important part because uh, I need it to be... Um, well, I need it to be sufficient that all production is uh, moved straight away. That's the important part. Because... Uh, all the excess so first how i see this let's say a uh, train comes in here it's going to be filled all the way and then while the train is unloading that oil this oil extra oil from the tank is being distributed in the chemical factories and then when the chemical factories are full which is not a lot of oil it's going to go uh, it's going to wait until the train comes along again and then when the train comes again it's gonna fill in the train. So uh, we are transporting more than we are producing, which is the goal. Um, currently 200 people are working here. We do have some extra oil, but this is gonna boost our oil supplies now as soon as we build a um, uh, line going here. So we're already at 100 tons of oil and some of the buildings are constructed already even here. I'm just gonna let them work on their own, uh, on their own pace, because we are pumping oil. We have two pumps connected to the system right now, and I think that's that warrants for a train. So, right, this is done. We're gonna go and buy electric uh, locomotive. Uh, I'm gonna go with the fastest one, uh, 110, 120, 75, 100. 110 or 120. Well, obviously 120 is faster one, but also it's a more powerful. No, 110 is more powerful. Huh. I don't think we need power because it's going to be only like two carts in the beginning. Or should I go for three just in case? You know what? Just in case I'm going to go for three. Because it's a bigger oil field and... Um, uh, just I don't want to send it back all the way to to depot if we need to expand and this way it can just wait there we go so load unload I'm pretty sure that you know what to do so low okay just in case load oil and unload oil and off you go I'm pretty sure it's reachable so don't be unreachable me because you can go this way unless we messed up with the uh, with the lights here which is definitely a thing no lights are fine here okay can you go here first right okay if you're gonna play like this yes I can I can definitely fix this I can do it it was just for me saving some money but fine you're gonna be difficult. Let's be difficult. Dun, 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 dun. Too steep of an incline. Okay, pausing. I'm gonna have to deal with this now. Just remove this and this, and then we're gonna do some flattening here. And just okay. <laughs> Obviously, doesn't like it at all. I think game game resents me for doing this now and not sometime later, like off screen. Uh, yeah, I just wanted it a second ago, so I'll find you. Where's the sweet spot? Come on. Ok, 
Okay, not here. Let's go a little bit further. Not here. Is this too far? Okay, who can play this game? Here we go. I know what you like. Okay, just to be on the safe side, let's do the further one first. And let's remove these semaphores here and here. So we can try to build it. I'm guessing that this is not gonna work. There we go. Oh, okay, this one doesn't look proper. proper. Okay, let's build this one and then we're gonna do partially this one and second partially this one. And now we have chain going in and you remove and remove. And we technically created the intersection here on two sides surrounded by... This one, we go out, chain goes in, and this one should be fine. I'm not sure about this light here, I'm just gonna leave it as it is, and uh, should work out. Okay, so we finished this, so we sponsored it on our own, and now you should be... Okay, first stop is unreachable. First of all, is it finished? Yes, it is. So why is it not reachable? Okay, it might be that we missed something on the railroad construction. So let's see here. This is reachable. This seems to be reachable. Oh boy, I know what's wrong. This rail line here doesn't have power on it. So we're gonna have to upgrade it. Oh. Okay, what about now? <laughs> uh, is it reachable now? Oh boy! <laughs> A new level of problems. Okay, so now it looks like our trains are having a power issue that we have probably too many, too long of a power... power cables, power lines. So we might need to build additional power supply for our electric uh, uh, train. Okay, uh, I can play that game as well, so uh, I didn't expect this, so soon at least. So if we build it somewhere close to here, and uh, let's go with... Uh, here we go. Is that it? Road electric connection. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that should be it, right? Oh, I can connect it on this side, so it can be... And I'm pretty sure that he's gonna now say, oh, you know what? Too steep. Yes, indeed. Uh, how is this on a hill? On the, especially on the hillside, it's on the hill. Fine. No, really? Fine, uh, we can remove the whole thing then. And then level the whole thing here. And then I'm gonna create... Uh, I probably shouldn't have done this here on the hilly side. Oh! Ha! There you go. And uh, quickly just connect another power source. There we go. And fixed. Oh no, they're still blinking. I'm pretty sure they shouldn't be blinking because... Okay, they stop now. Okay, there we go. Obviously this was an issue and uh, we shouldn't have built this intersection, but... Uh, 
Well, for maintaining the, the railroad, the carts, uh, I think it's, it's better safe than sorry. And then... Um, if we need to upgrade or something. Uh, but three carts of this is gonna take a while to fill in, so... That's resolved. Okay, so what do we have next? Do we have any of these buildings constructed? Not yet. Uh, we're building a, a, a residential building here. Supply office. No dice. You know what? I think we should finance this one. Uh, and I will, because we need this. Uh, we need to start getting rid of this food. Okay, now, the tough challenge. This is what I wanted to do one episode for, uh, for everything. But, uh, unfortunately, for all my distribution, but unfortunately I'm gonna have to do it like this. Covered hull, it's for uh, transporting of food. Yes, food is second one to the right, on the right hand side, second one. So, we're gonna need fast cars. So, we have two pages of these, fast trucks. We already did this before and I totally forgot. We have four ton vehicles. Let me just check these. Uh, we have here... This one has 7 ton capacity. What about big shopping centers? Big er shopping centers, so these ones. They have only capacity for 4 tons of food, so technically, and that's majority of our um, shopping centers, so we won't need more than 4 tons or 3.5 because I'm still gonna have backup. So let's go with this. We're gonna be build those. This is 4 tons, 3.5, but too slow. 5 tons, that's too much, 6 tons, 80 kilometers per hour, 90, but 700, 750 kilos. Yeah, I think uh, covered hull, I think that's about it, speed wise, uh, 90 kilometers per hour, low capacity, not 90 kilometers per hour. So we have two options, we have this one here, 4 tons, 87, or this one here, 5 tons, 88. What's the difference? Power. This one is more powerful. Uh, what you gonna do? So, we will try to supply as many, or if not all, shopping centers with food. So, we're gonna go from here, and then we're gonna start unloading. Uh, we're gonna go for 80%. All destination buildings, okay, they have to... Hey, let's go with 80%. I'm pretty sure that we should be lower than this, but let's go with 80 So, how many buildings do we have? Shopping centers. I already have four of them here. So, that means we have five buildings connected to this supply network. So, we have a shopping center here. That's it for this part of town. And then we have a shopping center here. And there should be one just about here. And if it can make it to Warstock, that would be awesome. Right, okay, so uh, one more. If we can get Vavkavisk, that would be awesome, but I'm not sure. Four, seven, eight. Oh, we have two more. Okay, that's awesome. As If I'm missing something, guys, put it down there. Come on, come on, there we go. Now, <laughs> I'm pretty sure that that's gonna be one busy uh, supply office. Right, but also, how fast is it filling? Oh yeah, that's, <laughs> that's filling quite fast. Alright. Okay, but I think all in all, it's... Sh yeah, we can produce much more, that's true. Okay, there's another one coming here, okay. Okay, let's keep it running like this. I want our people employed. So, do we have any workers here? Yeah, we have. We even have some workers in the... Okay, let's let's go let's go like this. I'm gonna lower the amount of workers to 100. That's gonna keep them to like half of this 185 or so, uh, 85 or something. So, uh, that's fine. That's being utilized. Uh, crops from this one. Oh, this is interesting. Will they be enough to... And no, this is interesting as well. We can place the intersection here and then the forklifts maybe uh, if we want to do the double thing here. Or, uh, yeah, maybe not. 
Maybe we can. Dun, 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 dun. Well, probably we can squeeze it in. I mean, like, I, I, I would find a way. Life finds a way. Uh, I would find a way to squeeze it in here, and then we can have intersection somewhere here or here. And that can be well connected with uh, food. But the, the, I don't think there's... Uh, it, it hasn't come to that yet. So, uh, what about here? Actually... No, no, it's too close. No, I think I, uh, in general, I made it too tight here, and uh, look, the best thing would be just to remove one of the fields, and that would be fine, but uh, it's fine anyway, so uh, I'm, I'm happy with how it's going. I mean, like, these trucks are going to be buzzing everywhere these days, nowadays, so I'm just going to leave them uh, at it. Um, they will be supplying... Well, I, I believe they will be cutting down on our... Uh, b well, uh, bread imports or food imports, which we can probably already notice. Uh, as first trucks roll out to Vavkavisk, sorry, uh, Varstok, with food, then uh, they. As soon as they arrive here, I think. Come on, where is it? What's this one? Oh, it's bringing workers. Oh, that's additional workers to the uh, to here. Yeah. Anyway, uh, let me see the food supplies nowadays. Okay, this is still not supplied. Uh, what about uh, what about this one? Okay, here we go. It's dropping, but is it dropping faster than we are supplying it with? I don't think so. We'll, we'll check it. We'll check in a few months how our food supplies are doing. Uh, for now, we're almost done with this one. Ooh, did I increase this to 40? No, I didn't. Are we getting more people? Oh, 100? Not really. And they're not moving to other buildings. We have 106 here and 100 here. Yeah, I think we can slowly start um, uh, filling those buildings in. But uh, I will need one of these guys finished. So which one is it? Uh, let's go with this one without people. So I need to finish this supply office. Because we need to start supplying the chemical factories. And can we do it in one go? So we need crops. How are we going to do the crops again? We didn't have access to this. We're gonna have to, if ever fires <laughs> fire starts here, we're gonna have to redo this one. And we do have some kind of weird connection through, yeah, through here uh, to this silo. Uh, yeah, I think that's the best way to go. And or I can go the to the railroad office, or I can go to the farm. Yeah, I think farm would be the best thing to do. It has the best roads here. Right, okay, so we have supply office here. So what will we need? Uh, I'm gonna just gonna pause for a second and as far as I remember this one requires chemicals This one requires chemicals. This one doesn't require anything but the fuel This one requires that. Okay, so we have one two and one two three That's five and then we need to supply these guys with one two three. So we need eight different um, uh, Offices or whatever they are Okay, so these guys, there's no workers here and there's no truck, so we're gonna need, uh, let's go with logger, and then we're gonna have to connect these guys with, um, well, so let, let's be as blunt as possible and uh, just do this, uh, because I'm pretty sure that we're not gonna have, uh, here we go, some of them are gonna go here for work, I believe, yes, indeed so. Uh, and I'm gonna have to build a kindergarten here. They still have uh, this to build. Okay, so um, I'm <laughs> I have a feeling that this could have been a smaller supply operation with a smaller supply office and this one could be with a bigger one with the food supplies. Um, we can still switch it. We can still switch it. It's just gonna be that these vehicles are gonna have to go here and uh, you know what? No, no, no. Let's just do it like this. So we have uh, three factories here. Uh, thus, this is unload, unload, unload. And then we have here... They're going to be load and unload. And then we're going to have here unload, unload. 
Yes, and this is unload. Jarnoviets chemical, and then we have uh, we need trees, gravel, and food. Uh, sorry, crops. There we go. So we have uranium. Wood cutting is loading, not unloading. And here we have Barahara Dagra Farm loading and not unloading. Okay, so what do we have? Uh, let's continue. So we have gravel. Uh, I think one of them is going to be enough. We'll see if it's going to be supplying all of them in time. Again, I'm going for speed. We need fast trucks here. Seven tons. Is this one it? 87. Yeah, this one is a, is a fast one. Oh, 90. Oh, well, this is 6 tons. And this is 89 tons. So, and this is 7. I'm fine with this one. Pretty sure he's going to be on his way straight away. Yes, on, on you go. Because it's going to deliver only gravel. That's fine. And then we have crops. Crops go... Oh, sorry. No, does he? Do they? No, do they don't. We have open hull. Open hull. Now, do we have another fast one? 90 kilometers per hour, only one and a half ton. That's a little bit low on capacity. But uh, let's see if we have anything faster. 90 uh, or bigger capacity. 85, 80. Okay, so this is the same, same version. Okay, and now we have covered hull. And we're going to have to have a few of those. Let's go for chemical, chemical, chemical. So we took three of them. They're gonna be delivering food and chemicals to to six places. So food from farm to chemical factories and then chemicals to to here. Well, I kind of hope that they already know what they're doing. So car chemical plant loading chemicals, unloading. Uh, this, this, and this. Same here, here, and here. And loading chemicals. And the same goes in here. So we have Jarnoviets chemical pan plants done. And here... Okay, so uranium. Okay. So, can you unload... Oh, no, 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 no. This is uranium. What is this? Processing plant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not you, not you. Uh, uranium processing plant is removed. Um, chemicals are unloaded to Jarnoviets uranium plant. And wood cutting load woods, of course. Gravel and then crops. We still need to add one more... Uh, I'm hoping we're going to do it in this episode. I'm pretty sure we're going to have time. Uh, this is uh, hopefully going to be done. Okay. Uh, they're busy now because there's so much stuff they're delivering. And they are... Are they? Okay. They're producing chemicals and loading them straight away. And I'm pretty sure that I will need more trucks here because they will be holding on here until they fill in with chemicals. Right, but they, they have all the ingredients. Okay, and somebody else is going to have to be delivering more. So I'm going to go for uh, two more. Okay, let's go with... Okay, two more. Two more uh, covered hulls. So this is all together seven, seven trucks. Is this enough? How many do we have here again? Five. No, this is not enough. So good thing that we chose this one because we will need seven of them. I'm pretty sure we're going to need seven. Uh, they're standing now, but uh, these guys are not going anywhere until they're full at least... Well, 100%. <laughs> uh, and that's a lot. Okay, so are we getting people here now? Are there more people working in this area? No. I think they're all uh, going to work in the... in the surrounding areas here. But uh, look, we need to start populating them. I'm going to go up to 100 in each building because I might have overbuilt here. What do we need? We need kindergarten, of course. Actually, I'm 
thinking, uh, yeah, I'm thinking I'm gonna build a kindergarten like, forcefully because this is really important for us right now. There we go, and now I'm gonna have to connect this kindergarten with everything else, so... Yeah, yeah, this is, yeah, this is just around the corner, that's fine. So you have kindergarten, but I'm pretty sure that you're gonna need a sports grounds. So I'm gonna go with football pitches as well, so... How many people are working here? I think this is too many. I think like five people is enough. Uh, there, there's already enough wood on the ground to keep our uh, chemical industry busy for a while. Okay, sports grounds. I'm gonna definitely put these guys here. There we go. Okay, I built it a bit, uh, maybe hastily. Uh, we could have invested in that because they didn't seem like they are busy. Actually, you know what? They're gonna be busy really fast now because I'm gonna get uh, a few hundred people. Okay, chemical industry is gonna start working out. And this, this is the big one. Okay, we still don't have uh, chemicals and we still don't have uranium. Why don't we have uranium? Uh, Uranium oxide. We should have. Oh no, we have uranium oxide, but why don't you have this? Because we don't have. Here we go. We have two of each. Now, come on, start producing uh, UF. UFs. Oh, I need to choose protection, right? No, okay, can chemicals, of course. Okay. Okay, I probably didn't have to do that, but fine. Okay, chemicals, come on, chop chop, we need those chemicals. Okay, it's soon, it's soon, soon, soon. <laughs> soon we're gonna be producing it. Oh wow, this is taking shape. Okay, this is gonna be good, this is gonna be good, but I'm still waiting for this one first. How much is to force finish it? Less and less, every passing second. Uh, oh! New t vehicle type. Okay. Let us see what that is. Cargo wagon. Twen oh, okay, so it's uh, 68 tons. Half the price of this. Sorry, 68. Half the price of this one. More or less. Uh, probably it's shorter, so it's more compact so is this one yeah I still don't get it this looks like it's bigger than both this and this so it could be that it's shorter and uh, bigger capacity so technically accommodates shorter trains how are we doing here guys how many pumping stations do we have connected yeah, still only two okay what in the world is this how did we okay you know what there we go finished it. Uh, purchase using dollars. What is this nearby? Is this a bus or train? Or train? Could be a... a oh. oh, last chance. Okay, we don't need that. Okay. Uh, slowly, slowly, but surely we're finishing this. Oh, they're coming from the town and working here. That's perfect. This is exactly what we need because there is uh, 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 th They can walk they can walk here and this is a proof that they can actually walk to work here. Actually, I think we knew that already uh, How far is it? 314 meters technically maybe is it possible that they can walk here to work as well? Nah. No, that's a little bit too far. I'm pretty sure that we can't even cut this any shorter, so that's fine. I mean, I actually, that could be a problem because we expected them to work, to walk to work here, right? Uh, that's fine. They, they can all be transported by bus. That's, like I already said, that's fine. 
Okay, did we produce? Yes, we have a hundred kilos of of UF six. I still don't need research what's UF six, but uh, uh, containers, no containers stored. So do we have to select this? Okay, so it has to fill in one container first for it to be ready to be exported. So uh, we still don't have a single container stored. That's fine. And uh, nuclear fabrication. Nuclear fabrication, indeed. Come on, we need you, 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 honey, you, you. Come on, chop, chop. Almost there, almost there. I already mentioned in previous episode that probably we won't be producing nuclear power yet in the next episode. I said that in previous, but I'm pretty sure in the next one we will. Uh, we don't have a lot of... Ooh, ooh, ooh. What? But you need chemicals. Okay, and why won't you let me assign this? Is it already assigned by any chance? Uranium... No. Okay, one more time. Oh, no, yes. Oh, yeah, okay. Fine, 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 fine. And we have, just don't be loading, and it's unloading. Chemicals, of course. Well, when it's the only one, they, they don't really choose. Beggars can be choosers. Uh, right, right, right. So, do we have any transported? Not yet, not yet. I'm hoping that it's gonna be here uh, soon, but... Uh, Okay, oh wow, there's workers. Oh yeah, they can walk to work, of course. So workers can walk to work here and here. And the cooling tower doesn't require any workers. Only 11 tons of concrete left. And a lot of, a lot of working days. Chop, chop, we need those... I'm, I'm <laughs> just looking where the where the containers are with the, with the nuclear fuel. Come on, chop, chop. Okay, they stop production because there's not enough workers. Bring workers. You, bring workers. Okay, <laughs> they're bringing some workers. But uh, we, we need we need more workers, of course. Uh, the problem is that uh, in uh, Zarnoviets at the moment, there's not enough uh, highly educated workers. So I'm going to have to push for these guys here. They're going to be much, much more expensive. But um, th that's what we need. So, let's get it here. Let's see how we're doing. Students are not welcome here, because we don't... Okay, here we go. We have some highly educated people as well. Hopefully, they're going to be transported to this work area. So, what do we need? We have everything we need to process the... Uh, oh, they already got chemicals. That's perfect. We have everything to process. How many chemicals are they? Oh, boy. So once they got the chemicals, they don't really need that many of them. So uh, maybe we don't need so many supply vehicles for the for the chemicals. Uh, and also, how many chemicals we're going to be using? I have no idea. Half a ton a day times three. That's a ton and a half a day. And this one is consuming half of that. Hmm, actually around one ton a day of chemicals and uh, what's wrong with this one no power supply uh, yeah that's a tricky one how do we get can we get a windmill or something here uh, why right okay uh, Yeah, I really don't want to move stuff around, but uh, it's funny thing how a uh, petrol station next to a nuclear power plant doesn't have power. Uh, that's just going to be additional wires that I'm going to build now that I really, really don't want to build. And uh, I don't think I'm going to have any choice. And probably I can just use the cheapest ones. Where can I build this uh, transformer station? Somewhere that is going to be extremely awkward and uh, I won't be able to remove it for a while. Uh, 
and uh, I'm pretty sure that a lot of uh, cons power consumers are going to be connected to this and it's not going to be supplying enough power. Okay, it is. <laughs> okay, but at least we have a working uh, petrol station and this is the biggest petrol station in 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 the Star Soviet Republic. Oh. Okay, so what's the deal with this one here? Uh, yes, this is not needed anymore, so uh, both this intersection and those lights are not needed. So feel free to go. You are supposed to be going here and you... Okay, you're going out. Okay, at least this is, this is gonna be resolved now. But uh, this guy shouldn't have ended here, so what do we have here semaphore-wise? Okay, this is resolved. The world makes sense one more time. Okay, we're already over time, so just let's try to recap what we did here. We did food supplies. We bought five trucks in the <laughs> Barahara distribution office that we're never, never gonna see in the office because just got, they're gonna be on the road all the time. Uh, did we do I did a good job or not? I don't know. We're, do we, are we producing too much food? Yes. Uh, that's definitely. Uh, we put our chemical plants up in production and looks like they're oversupplied with chemicals at the moment uh, because our nuclear power plants are not working, so that's um, an issue maybe? Maybe. We'll see. Uh, so we are overproducing chemicals. Uh, we have two new distribution offices and we're building the rest of the Zharnoviets. Uh, one distribution office is in charge of supplying chemical factories with resources and also chemicals to the nuclear industry we got a couple of other construction construction we're constructing a couple of other offices here uh, so we have uh, the uh, Lesha medium distribution office that's going to be for our fuel distribution of our petrol stations and we finished and resolved a couple of issues concerning oh more oil is being pumped uh, here we go one more pumping station it's only pumping stations left to be constructed and that's that's it uh, what's happening here we have a train with oil uh, and I think this is a maiden voyage. First time that is going to be delivering oil here to the Leicester refinery, which is um, maybe slightly struggling. Uh, what's with the capacity? What's the people here? Okay, they are happy. I mean, like they're they're staying there. They're not leaving, so that's fine. And we have uh, finally this area here, which is not working. For now, well, actually, how many people? They filled it all the way in. So, did I really not build a shopping center here? Ha! Huh. Color me embarrassed. Are we gonna have to rush quick, quick, <laughs> quick, uh, quick build this one as well? So, small shopping center, and uh, we can build it here for our peeps. Uh, here we go, and I would like to connect it just real quickly here. And just not to forget uh, later, uh, I'm just going to add this one to our food distribution network. Yes, and I need to make sure that it's unload only and it is unloading and it's going to be food. So food, fresh food is going to be delivered here. There's a lot of other stuff we need to dis uh, resolve now. Uh, a lot of uh, trucks that we have running around uh, that are related to clothing. Uh, maybe even food distribution? <coughs> Probably not, but um, clothing definitely. I don't see trams running around, it, so they're stuck again. We're gonna have to resolve that. But anyway, guys, that's about it. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this one. Uh, if you did, press the like button. If you didn't, leave a nasty comment in the comment section. Uh, let me know what you think. Like, subscribe, notification bell. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.